He's nothing if not devoted. Politics might as well be his middle name. As the veteran lawmaker himself puts it, who needs free time? Jean-Claude Juncker, Luxembourg's leader for 18 years, chairman of the Eurogroup, head of the EU Commission for two years, it's hard to imagine the EU without him. But lately he's come under reproach. People say he belongs to the past. He doesn't mind playing along. In this video spoof, with no lack of self-deprecation, he signs a parchment with a quill. Juncker certainly doesn't lack experience. Whether it's the debt crisis, the migration crisis, or Brexit, his refrain is the same. We need more Europe, not less. The question is, do others want it too? Is he still the man of the hour? Alex Baudry doesn't share Juncker's politics, but he praises the man's character. He has mastered the art of communication down to the smallest detail. He's always ready with the right response at the right moment. That's his strong suit. He knows how to deal with his opponents very well. He manages to create just the right room to maneuver a good bargaining position. He's an excellent negotiator and a bridge builder between European cultures. But Baudry adds that Juncker can also be a man of one-syllable answers. Asked if Brexit spells the end of the EU, he replied simply, no. Il perd quelque peu de ses moyens. He can lose his brilliance in political oratory when he feels attacked, when he's the focus of criticism. Then he goes on the defensive. That's definitely a weakness on his part. And yet, many in Brussels still regard Jean-Claude Juncker as one of the very few who can set a common course for the European Union, despite, or perhaps because of, his old-world passion for this continent.